Well, crates are paying double money and double RP for the week that I'm recording this video. I'm inside one of my large warehouses. It is completely full. I have five of these large warehouses. We're going to go ahead and we're going to try and sell all of these in a public lobby. So here is one here. I have another one here. Another one here. Another one here. And my final one is up here. They are all large warehouses. They are all full. I had a good look at this lobby. It looks to be... There's one guy in a scramjet here. Not too worried about him. Two guys here. Both have bounties on them. You know what? I think we're good. I think we can do this. Let's log in. Let's have a look here. So we're going to sell all 111 crates for $4,440,000. But of course we're going to get the high demand bonus selling in a public lobby. Okay, we've got the brocades. Single drop for each. This one You're should be easy enough to do. Let's see, where are we heading to? Right past <laughs> the two guys with the bounty. This could be fun. We are heading straight towards this guy who's got a bounty, so this could be... Get rather interesting really quickly now. What's he going to do? Is he going to ignore us? Is he going to chase after me? He doesn't appear to be moving. I think we're okay for now. There's the first one delivered. Let's get back to the second one. Uh, seems to be okay, no one near them, so we're oh, right into a telegraph pole. <laughs> That's one way of doing it, isn't it? Well, we're looking good so far. Let's get back to that second one. Okay, we're back with jumping into the second truck here now. Just checking the map, they're all going to the same locations by the looks of it. Okay, pulling up now with the second one. Oh, oh no. Come on, get back to the oppressor. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And now we're looking down there. Still no one near that, uh, near my warehouse, so that's good. Yeah, we're looking good. I haven't had to use um, Ghost or Get either. Um, I think I will save it just in case I need it for one of my other warehouses. Because uh, there is a cooldown period, I don't know how long the cooldown period is. I don't want Ghost Talk to be on cooldown when I actually need it. But it looks like I don't need it just yet. Everybody seems to be keeping to themselves. Here we go, third and final truck now. There is the third one delivered. Now we've got some enemies we need to take care of, so... Ah, uh, here we go, get the uh, rail gun out. And they, where are they coming from? There we are, there's one up here. Just like that. There's 
another one there. So we've got, we've got 18, we've got a kill total, so that's four done. We died. The rockets on the oppressor ain't what they used to be. That is 10 down. What is going on with my oppressor? Why is it up in the sky like that? Can I get on it? There we go. And there we go, sold six hundred uh, six million six hundred and sixty thousand dollars thanks to the high demand bonus. Let's head off to the next uh, warehouse now. Okay, so I'm at warehouse number two. Let's do it. The sale's on, but it's kind of complicated. You'll be dropping... Not the one I was wanting. It's the ten drops with the uh, Titan. This one's going to be fun in a, in a public lobby. Okay, there it is. Let's go. Ah, uh, with this one I've got to fly low or I risk getting detected by the cops, so this is going to make it even more fun. Particularly if anybody decides they want to have a bit of fun trying to grief me. It's all right. It's one vehicle. Ten drops. And I just heard an explosion. That's not what I want to be hearing right now. I can't fly any lower. I'm going to crash into that hill. Right, the best thing about this mission is most of the drops are up in the southern area of Blaine County, so less populated by players. Though thus far I have noticed a lot of players seem to be keeping to themselves, doing their own thing. Listen game, I can't go any higher. Any any lower, sorry, any lower. Okay, drop the first. Make sure we're going in the right spot. And, oh, I've got to lose the cops. Fantastic. I flew too high, got a wanted level. So this is great. Can I call Lester? Hey, what's up? Oh, how can I help? Get the no cops problem. off me, man. I'll get them off your back. I don't know how, how low this game wants me to fly. Like, seriously. If I fly any lower, I'm going to crash into the ground, damn it. Oh, I heard another explosion. 
at least they are nowhere near me. That is the main thing right now. So we're six drops down, four more to go. That is drop number eight. Okay, look, let's bank right here. Let's grab this one here first since it's closer. And because there are, looks like there are players close to that other one on the left, so. There we go. Okay, they're actually further away than I thought they were, but here we go, coming in, one more drop to make. And that is our second warehouse sold, $6,660,000. Okay, I'm here at my third warehouse now. Let's, uh, let's do this. Okay, it's given me the trucks with the uh, single drops again. So this is not a bad mission to get. Where are we going? Oh, it's the Tractify one. This is a pain in the neck. I believe I know where we're going. I believe we're going to the Noose Headquarters. Yes, we are. Okay, come around. How do I get into where the drop is? It's in there, okay. Need to call in my oppressor to get back. Where's that gonna spawn? Over there, that's great. Couldn't have spawned closer for me. Okay, I think it's going to be the same spot, so I'm just... Okay, it is. It's just giving me a waypoint, so that's awesome. So I don't have to bother doing the Tractify again with the next two. That is awesome. Okay, that makes it much easier now, then. I know that all three trucks are going to the same spot. Okay, I've got to bring this one in from the opposite side now. Oh, don't tip over. And this time let's call in the Sparrow. And that spawned over in the same spot as well. What's the point of that then? Ah, now my... Oppressor spawned over this way. Seriously, come on. Why didn't you spawn there the first time, man? God, yeah, let's go. Let's go get back this this last truck. Okay, last truck. Let's go. Let's go.
Okay, coming in with the last one now. And there we go, that is the third warehouse sold, $6,660,000. Let's get back to the last, uh, got, sorry, two more to go. <laughs> Let's get back to the fourth one now. Okay, my fourth warehouse. Let's go. Which one's it going to be this time? It's, go it's the plane. It's going to be, uh, it's the three planes, the, the Cubans. Okay, this one's not so bad. I'm going to have to take three Cubans up into Blaine County. There's going to be some NPCs there. The worst part is going to be coming back. Uh, leaving two planes down here at LSIA. This is the mission you really don't want. Doing it solo in a public lobby. That's doable, but the risk of being griefed is greater with this one. Okay, so we're going to come and land in here and there's going to be some NPCs we need to take out once we land. the tank-like vehicle heading down towards the airport has me a little bit concerned. Just keep an eye on it. Yep, yeah, he's actually going nowhere near me. That's great. Okay, got NPCs to take out now. Get the fuck back! Everybody get back! Okay, it's three more, four more. Stop running away. Okay, where did my presser spawn? All the way over there, are you kidding me? Okay, that guy there had me worried for a second. He was coming down to the airport rather fast. And he just seems to be going away now. Okay. Well good, we're at the second plane. Let's go. Okay, that is the second plane landed. Now, where is my oppressor going to spawn? In the bloody same spot it did last time, isn't it? It has. Great. Um, is there a car here or something I can steal to get over there? There's not. Fantastic. Oh, hello. No, I can't steal that. Okay. What about my sparrow this time? Okay, we're back down in the airport, LSIA, for the final Cuban. Let's get this done. Uh, 
Okay, we've got a couple of oppressors. A, uh, is that a tank or something? Kinjali, maybe? A night shark? I don't know. But he's seeming to be okay to leave me alone. They're just worried about each other by the looks of it, so it's cool. You do you guys. I'm doing me. Not the best landing, but there we go. That is now the fourth large warehouse sold for six hundred. Sorry, for six million six hundred and sixty thousand dollars in a public lobby. I'm now in my final warehouse. It needs selling. But on my way back here, I notice somebody is in a Raiju in stealth mode. Oh, there he is over there. He's not in stealth mode right now. Uh, I also got shot by another oppressor as I was flying past. He claimed he shot me because oppressor danger. That it wasn't that. Yeah, it was a preemptive strike. He was taking care of me before I took him out. Apparently, but anyway, this last uh, warehouse could be fun. Good to look. And we got single drops of the brocades. Which one is it? Okay, we're going all the way up through the city. Fantastic. If I'm going to get griefed on any of them, it's going to be this one, I think. Fantastic. Not only am I worrying out about... Oh, there we go. Okay, this guy might be um, escorting me rather than trying to grief. I was about to say, not only do I have to deal with potential griefers, but I've also got NPCs coming after me now. Now he's in stealth mode, that guy in the Raiju. This is going to be a lot of fun. This is. <laughs> Not going to lie, I'm a bit nervous here. been lucky so far, it's been a very peaceful, very peaceful lobby. Nobody has come near me apart from the guy who killed me a moment ago, claimed claimed that he killed me because I was on an oppressor and he was just worried he was going to get taken out first. Okay, there is the first one sold. Let's get back to the oppressor and get down to the next one. There seems to be a few people leaving this lobby, which is not good for me when it comes to the high demand bonus. Uh, what do we got there? It's 18 in here at the moment. I think 20 is what I need to get the max high demand bonus.
Let's hope a few more people will come back <laughs> before I finish this cell mission. Yeah, there we go, second one delivered. We have absolutely no hiccups whatsoever with that second delivery. Not that we had any with the first one either, but I was a bit concerned with the guy in the Raiju following me. Let's head back and grab the last truck, which is also the last vehicle I need for selling all of my five large warehouses. Okay, here's the last truck. Let's go. The rain is coming down. It is pouring here in Los Santos. And I have one final truck to deliver from all of my warehouses. The thing that sucks the most here now is the uh, number of people in the lobby seems to be dropping. I've made 6,660,000 from each of my other four large warehouses. I'm not going to make that much with this one, I don't think, unless a few more people enter the lobby before I reach, reach the uh, final destination with this final truck. Yeah, that, that player list has dropped to 16 players now, myself included in that. So the high demand bonus is not going to be as good here. If I really cared, I could just uh, close down the game. I'd then have to go back to this warehouse and source another three crates to fill it back up again. But I'm not too concerned about the, the full high demand bonus. As you can see there, I don't need the money. It's the purpose of doing this video was uh, to show selling all five large warehouses in a public lobby. I have done that, we're coming into the last, last truck right now. Here we go, and what do we get? Still over six million, so six million one hundred and twenty seven thousand two hundred that time, so we still made, oh, what is that, $33 million, and we ranked up. So, yeah, that's, uh, we'll take that as a win, guys. That's $33 million in roughly about an hour of doing those cell missions, just under an hour, probably 40 minutes. Uh, but, again, it took a long time to fill up, and sadly, that means I've now got to go back around all my warehouses, pay the stuff to source crates again. Uh, whenever I get on the game, I've got to do that now. Uh, but what I'm looking forward to the most now is if I come into career progress, come to businesses, come all the way to further finance, further advance. Can I read? Can I speak? Further adventures in finance and felony. Let's come along to tier four here. This is the only one I need to complete is source all types. I need the Sasquatch hide. These are the special items you get through. Um, through your warehouses if you pay Lupe to, or her staff to do it there is a very rare chance they'll bring back one of these special items they cannot be sold in bulk with your other crates if you didn't know so you can only sell them on their own there are six different types and I've had five of them so far you can also get these um, if you are manually sourcing crates after a while I think it might be um, after you've sourced 18 crates or thereabouts you'll get a phone call it might even be less it could be more I don't know exactly uh, it's something I'll test out in the future. You get a phone call from your assistant, and what you need to do if you get that phone call and she's telling you about one of these special crates, don't go to a new invite only session. If you are trying to knock this off from your career progress, don't don't go to a new invite only session, new session, whatever. Go straight to your office. Like actually, actually regular travel to your office and head up to your assistant and you can start the mission there. So, fingers crossed I can get that Sasquatch hide. That is the last one I need for the career progress here with, to do with the Crates Warehouse. 
Anyway, as the rain pours down, that is going to do it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please drop a like. If you want to see more GTA content like this, go ahead and smash that subscribe button. And I'll see you in the next video. Cheers.